On the east coast of Canada, iconic Atlantic salmon are environmentally, economically, and culturally important. In Newfoundland's Campbellton River, researchers are evaluating how fisheries stress and warming temperatures are affecting Atlantic salmon health by investigating changes in virulence of naturally occurring fish pathogens. Researchers conducted simulated fishery stressors and monitored survival and condition of fish after release. Fish were collected at a counting fence and either displaced downriver or placed in an in-river holding tank after the fisheries treatment. To investigate changes in disease over time, small gill samples were taken before and seven days after treatment. RNA will be extracted from these samples for qPCR analysis to identify what microbial pathogens are present and whether fishery stress has altered fish immune function, allowing the pathogens to become more virulent. Ongoing lab work will evaluate the role that fisheries capture and a warming climate have on Atlantic salmon gene expression and pathogen presence in this remarkable fish species.